guys, Mr. Ross 99 here is going to be Foot Champs Rewards video. Yes, here we go. Body Smart Bloating in a couple of days. Reason for that being, I have been grinding the SBC, uh, no, sorry, the um, objectives in whenever I. Oh, I can't get to them in a minute, can I? Um, what can I? Where are they again? No, everything's in the way. Basically, the Mendy objectives. Bruno Fernandez objectives just to get those cars and then I've not got a massive amount of time to play for you for a day anyway so and of course with it being Father's Day on Sunday as so I went to see my family I've got a little boy of my own as well so I kind of took a day off uh, of playing FIFA-ish got to 14 wins in foot champs so I got to gold free now looking at some of the rewards I've seen online so far I'm opening these packs at 3 o'clock in the afternoon this was packs I was watching when I was at work on my break the rewards look really, really, really bad for the for the red players anyway, even for like the top 100 players. I'm panicking a little bit. I wouldn't mind some good players, but at the same time, we're at a stage now where I've got the team I want in FIFA. A couple of changes. I mean, if I hit like a team that's easy Ronaldo or something crazy, obviously they get into my team and they make my team better. But we'll get straight into it. Let's go. We're going to go for... I don't actually know where I finished in this. I paid a lot more rivals than I normally do, because like I said, for the objectives. But that seems like a lot of packs are untradeable, so we will take that. Is that rank 1? Or is that rank 2? Well, that was rank 1. Okay, that's, that's not a shock because, like I said, I played a lot more rivals than I normally would for it being the objectives. So we go for our foot champs, like I said, we got gold free. Uh, I could have, I got 14 and 6, so I had 10 games remaining. Um, so I could have easily got gold 2, to be honest, but I just couldn't be bothered to play the extra games. When it got, when it got my last win, it was quite late in the day. So not expecting madness. I've only got a choice of 3 players and I've got no, like, 90... I think if you get gold two, you get like a 90, at least one player over 90, if that makes sense. So I've got no limit. I've just got a free for all. So if we take anybody half decent, anybody fun, or anybody high rated for an SBC, I'm not too fast at all. So get straight into it. Oh, oh, I mean, yes. That, I mean, considering that's gold three, three 90 plus players pop up, and I'm not even too sure who I'm picking here. It's going to be in between Giovinco, who I'm tempted by massively. Or oh, this Murillo guy who looks pretty good as well. I think I'm going to go for Giovinco. I am. We're taking Giovinco. I'll take that every day of the week. I'm fully expecting absolute horseshit from here. And there we go. That's what <laughs> that is literally what I expected from this. Um, I mean, that's bad. But I'll take the first one as an absolute beast. Giovinco is a very, very fun card. Now, that Kappa is an old inform, isn't it? Or is that like a headliner or something? I can't remember. Trippier there as well. I mean, English right back. He could get into my team, but then uh, is he any good? Oh my god, that's God Cardozo. I recognise that face. He used to be an absolute animal with a different name. Anyway, don't matter. He's probably the one I'm going to go for for rating wise. Um, 87 rate for SBCs will come in handy. Trippier won't get into my team. I was only joking, but that is not bad for goal three. Very happy with Giovinco. That's a really, really tiny super sub at, at worst. Could even get into the main team. Depending on what I'm what I'm using at the time, he's difficult to link for his, his league, but his nation is very good in Italian, and of course icons come in handy. Let's open these packs. Let's freaking go. We're gonna start off with the lower raised packs. We're just gonna go from left to right, whatever pops pops. But smash the like button for better better rewards. Here we go. First pack. Are we gonna get anything good at all? We're gonna get ourselves not even a board. So that's awesome. Uh, when I was opening packs the other day, I was doing a lot of the 80 plus packs or whatever. He's actually signed for Dortmund in real life, if I'm not mistaken. That's actually not a bad card to get. I don't know if that's tradable or untradable, but I imagine he sells for a tiny bit. It's untradable. What price is he going for? See, he's like a 5k player, which is just mental, really. Definitely would recommend opening packs at the minute if you've got um, coins left. That's a shame. that he, A lot of these are going to be untradable. I need to rinse more of my untradables. See, he's untradable as well. I will quick sell them if I have to go in and get anybody from the quick sell recovery. I haven't used any of my quick sell recoveries this month yet or whatever it is. So I can do that, but an 82 isn't really going to keep me up at night. I'll take whatever it is. So this is actually going to be a non-walkout, an on-board even again, uh, which is not great. So we're not getting the best luck in the world, but a left back, variety rated. I mean, these packs were never going to be fantastic anyway. These are like the dead packs, which you get just for playing. I mean, they're all untradeable, so they'll go into some sort of SBC or whatnot. Hopefully he's tradable. Yeah, that's fine. We'll just switch these anyway. Sometimes these end up being, you know... That's actually the ball I use, apparently. We get ourselves 83 coins back for that, and that goes a long way, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to open the next pack. Let me know in the comment section below who you managed to get in your rewards. Or if you didn't even play this week. Wouldn't surprise me at all if you didn't play. That, again, is a non-ball. We're going to skip that one because we don't even care who that is. Wasting time. 
Is it somebody half decent? I mean, there is some alright 82s. It is not. Again, untradeable. So, it is what it is. Get the whales kit as well, then we will discard that. But naught coins, absolute joy. So our last jumbo pack now, and then I think we go into the 50k packs. Again, 50k packs for me are very, very hit and miss. I probably will do the 50k pack last, though. I did say I was going to go from left to right. I've lied. But yes, we don't get a single board from all those jumbo packs, which is pretty shite, really. We've got an Italian striker there, which is going to be Zaza, I'm sure. Hello? I don't even know what I saw there, to be honest. He's probably going to sell for a little bit. He's untradeable, and that's uh, oh, very good. Very two coins. Here we go. We're into the better packs now. So I've got three rares, and I've got a mixed contracts pack. We'll open that next. Why not get ourselves some free contracts? They're all tradable, but we'll whack them into this club regardless. We're going to open the mega packs first. I feel like the rare players packs will give potential for better players than a mega pack. But we want to see some high rate fodder here. We want to be able to do another icon SBC. We get ourselves a board, not a walkout. Who's it going to be? Venega? Who's that? Oh, Otto. Oh! If that's tradable, I think someone was saying to me the other day, Otto Mendy is going for crazy dollar. Probably untradable, no, my luck. Yeah, he's untradable. Is he going for those stupid coins? I mean, yeah, it is. everyone's really going for that in the minute, to be fair. He might come in handy for an SBC anyway, so we'll keep him in the club. We'll just see if anybody can... There's going to be some players in my club which are untradeable, which I haven't got rid of yet, as you can see them two there. A lot of non-rares are probably untradeable. I haven't really rinsed my non-rares for a little while. I uh, probably need to to get rid of them, because when I open packs like this, they're just getting discarded when they could be going back into the club. But we soldier on. We haven't got ourselves a walkout yet. Still pretty chuffed with Giovinco, actually. I think that's a very, very decent poll. It's a team of the season, so we'll take it. This is another board or walkout. It's a walkout in form, I want to say. German. Cam. Who's that? Stindle? It is? I didn't even know Stindle had 85 in form. We'll take it. 85 in form fodder. Get in the team. Or get in the club. I'm not going to have him in the team. I did used to have a team of the season Stindle years and years ago on FIFA. I can't remember what FIFA that was. He was a baller. He was like a centre forward or something. And he was a very good team of the season. Oh, and a PK. Oh, that's naughty. That is an untradeable pack though. But that is very, very nice indeed for the fodder. We will take that. And that guy as well. I thought it was like a special card for a second, and I thought it was like an informed base, and of course it's just M1. So that's a bit of a shame, because he probably sells for a little bit. But, is what it is currently, the comp. Let me just see a second, actually. Is that a really bad dis- Nah, it's only 1.6k. We're not going to lose sleep over that. But I would have like, you know, would have took it anyway. Let's get rid of that piece of shit. And we'll, we'll soldier on. We will soldier on. Hopefully, that is a sign of things to come. That was a very, very nice mega pack. That was an Inform 85 and an 88 PK. So fully expecting that to be the PK of our luck. We get ourselves, I think that's an Inform non walkout. So who's that going to be? Joaquin? Tello? What? 83 Inform? So just on the peak of not being a walkout. But is there something, as they call a dangler, in this pack? Somebody hiding behind the Jacqueline? No, it's not. And, of course, that's the tradable one. I mean, not bad. We'll keep it all in the club in a minute. We'll sort it out another time. Some of these might sell for a little bit. Get rid of them ones. Yes, please. 516 coins back. Can we make it? Just give me a freaking icon. Let's have an icon in this pack. Imagine the limbs. I'm not actually hit an icon in a while now, apart from the guaranteed ones. And of course, when I say that, we get ourselves a non-board, which is going to be... I mean, that is pretty far, man. Fair, man. That's where it says fair. You ask for an icon, you get a piece of shit instead, and that's probably tradable. Yes, it is. I swear to God, every time I get a tradable pack, it is bang average. We'll get rid of all of them. Sometimes they sell for a little bit. I don't really know, but we'll get rid of them anyway. Three rare players packs. 50k packs. Normally, horseshit for me, but this is the day it changes. That is a board or a walkout. That is a walkout. Is that an inform? Who is that? It's not Lewandowski. Oh, I saw an Outovich again. I mean, why don't you know I thought that was Lewandowski has an Austrian flag? But, we've already got him, I'm pretty darn sure. I'm a little bit, if that's a... Oh, yeah, it's an untradeable pack. We did get an 87 Bernardo Silver in there as well, as well as an Otamendi. We just got a minute ago untradeable. That is annoying. Oh, that is very annoying. That is very, very annoying if he is as well. Oh, damn! 
Well, they're going to have to get discarded, but I will probably bring those two back. He can get a gun on there. I will probably bring those two back for the quick sale recovery, because they're, they're cards I would like to have just as fodder. That's a bit of a shame, but we go on. Again, we got a walkout in there. We did actually get Bernardo Silva as a duplicate walkout because we got the team of the season and uh, the informal walkout. This is the 50k pack we know and love. That is a non as a board. Oh, actually, to be fair. Oh, my God. <laughs> Sometimes players can be hiding behind here. He played for Brighton the other night, didn't he? He's a Brighton player. Please, for the love of Christ, be somebody hiding behind him because I think they block like a board. No, there really wasn't a board. Oh, my God. That is horrific. That's untradeable. Please be tradable. Oh my god, we got we just got farming a minute ago. Oh, but apparently was, that was an untradable pack, so one ebbs. You can't trade him off. Gotta get rid of some of this fodder. I'm apparently stacking high on some of the, the rares that we can get rid of now. But we'll get rid of them again. Again, I think I've got five I can get back. So Rudiger might be another one we get back. But final pack! Smash the like button if you haven't already subscribed if you are new. Break the luck. So at least have a board, please. It is. Can it be huge? It is a Libertadores, I believe. B. Tevez. No, who's left mid? Oh, I don't know who that is. Doesn't look great. Oh, it's Moosh. Mooshy. Moosh. We'll take him. 86 rated. I think I've already got him. Or I may have rinsed him into an SPC. Either way, I think that one's tradable. Oh, it is. That's actually not too bad. We got ourselves two. I actually, yeah, I rinsed him into an SBC. I rinsed that Jose Perez into an SBC as well. So for cards in particular, we've not done bad fodder-wise. We've not done bad wise of players we can sell. We didn't get mega, mega players. But we all take what we got and we will roll with it. Squad, I'm currently rocking. There it is. As you can see, we are doing the Mendy and the, the this guy objectives. Uh, he's not too bad. I didn't actually have him already, so I had to go and play the games to get him. But Mendy, I'm on to the 89. I've just got to get assists, basically, to get Mendy. Which is a, it's turning into a little bit of a grind. It started off alright. I got the goals pretty quickly. A lot of people had me help. Also, I'm two games away from the 91, Bruno Fernandes, and that will start all kicking on. But I'm 5 out of 10 on the assists for Mendy. So we've got 5 more assists in 5 different games needed to get him. Could take ages. Could take 5 games. Literally is like that. But well, thank you very much for watching. If you're new around here, like I said before, don't be afraid to subscribe. I will catch you next time and do bye bye. Let's go. Not too bad. Not too shabby on though.